it's unique. You don't know what to expect when you go down. And every time you go down, you see something different. Mostly, it's beautiful and mesmerizing. U-Boat Works is currently uh, expanding quite a lot. We have a growing number of clients, growing number of interest. Uh, we are the world leading manufacturer in private owned and mini submersibles. Our latest model is called the Nemo. It's a two-seater submersible that goes to 100 meters of depth. With every new submersible we design, we keep pushing the technical boundaries. We want to go deeper, faster, we want to build lighter subs, and we want to improve the experience to the clients. After uh, we had the first ID for the Nemo, we wanted to have a proof of concept as quick as possible. And therefore, we started with wooden makeups just to see if the ergonomics are right, see if you fit within a sphere this small. And the next step is to go to SolidWorks really quickly and check if you get your buoyancy right, your mass right, and see if your whole ID is feasible. One of the most important things is that our vision, what we have in our heads, is to visualize that and give it to our customers. With SolidWorks, we can ask the program very quickly, what does it weigh? What is the, the volume, the displacement in the water? Are we on target, basically? At a certain point of time, we are uh, roughly working with 20 different designers. So it's important that we all speak, all work with the same tool, and it doesn't interfere with each other. The center of gravity and the center of buoyancy are uh, the most important parts when you're designing a submarine, because they need to be uh, perfectly aligned to maintain stability while diving, as well as on the surface. If it is not in balance, it sinks to the bottom. If it's not in balance, it rises to the surface. So everything needs to be spot on, just to Imagine that this is the material we need to hold the pressure and make it all safe for the passengers. And normally we build around one sub a year per type. For the Nemo we would like to build one sub every month. So that's a really big change in the whole production process. Therefore we try to standardize the components that we already use on our uh, other submarines to ensure a, a fluent production process for the Nemo. Well, the best part of my job is when all the parts are coming in and you start assembling your submarine. So you've been working within SolidWorks and see it on your screen all the time. But when it really comes alive, that's, that's really the, the fun part.